Hello everybody, Jason here from Sony Gaming with another episode of my Mass Effect 2 playthrough. We missed a little bit of recording last week, but uh, we're back on track, kind of. We might miss some, uh, we might miss some more recordings here in the next couple weeks, but it's just kind of one of those things where I'm just kind of, uh, Looks like there's some people in here that want to talk to us here. Where the heck do I even find them at? Engineering deck. Yeah, I see. Let's go check for them on the fourth level here. Got two people that want to talk to me, and then we'll continue on here. Try to hopefully get somebody's missions done. Cargo hold. Rubber cargo or port cargo? No way it's behind me. There's Grunt. Chambers said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong, tense. I just want to kill something with my hands. More so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just wanna... I don't know. See? Why do that? What's wrong? Okir didn't imprint anything to help you figure this out? I see pictures of old battles. Voices of warlords. But this is a blood haze in my head. I want control. When we're moving, fighting, I focus. But here, my blood screams, my plates itch, and even you are just noise. I'm tank-born. What is this? Don't know if I can help, Grunt. Sounds like we need one of your kind to look into this. Most off-world Krogan are warriors. Doctors don't leave the homeworld to Junka. I won't ask you to go there. I will control this. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. Okay. And then the other one was in the sub-level. Tight little group you got here, and a pretty nice ship. You'd be rich if you took to piracy, but you wouldn't. I can't figure you, Shepard. Doesn't matter. I've got to talk to you about something. I'm listening. 
I got thoughts like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes? I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man? Never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility. I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. I'm gonna talk to the elusive man, and he better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pragia, where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. Our mission is the priority. If we have time, we'll go there. Don't wait too long. I need to do this soon. I need it. Personal sense that I see. Important news. No, you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Too important to wait. Just receiving data. Still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You know about the genophage? Only about one Krogan pregnancy in a thousand leads to a live birth, thanks to a Solarian virus. Mm, right. Virus released a thousand years ago controlled Krogan population ever since. All public knowledge, but I know more. Recent generations of Krogan started adapting. Genophage losing effectiveness. I hadn't read anything about the Krogan population increasing. Why has nobody noticed? Because it never happened. I stopped it. My team and I personally led a team, created new version of Genophage, released it onto Chanka, other colonies, restabilized Krogan population. I doubt you wanted to give me a history lesson. What's going on? Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member, Malin. Last seen on Tuchanka might torture him, make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. We'll go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pack. Talk to them or Clan Chief. All right. So a lot of going on at Tuchanka. Miranda wants to see you, Commander. Right. Fuel at one half capacity.
What do we want to do? Landing in the place where we can lay, uh, recruit two members. Probably recruit one and call it a day. Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid all fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier, as well. Twenty-five. Excuse me. Excuse me, are you Commander Shepard? Are you shorting prefabs? Why not? I did it after he did the crime. Paid for new exosuits for my kids. You're insane. You're Commander Shepard? I saw your... I guess you would say your aura. I'd recognize you anywhere. I was asked to give you a message if I saw you. It's from a friend you made on Novaria. What message were you asked to give? Shepard, we hide. We borrow. We build. But we know that you seek those who soured the songs of our mothers. When the time comes, our voice will join with yours. And our crescendo will burn the darkness clean. Thank you, Shepard. The Rachni will sing again, because of you. I'm glad to hear that you're rebuilding. Are you somewhere close by? The Rachni Queen is not here. That message is one of many memories I carry from her. I encountered her on an uncharted world. She saved my life. More than that, she gave me a purpose. They are an amazing people, Shepard. The galaxy owes you a great debt for giving them a second chance. Thank you for giving me that information. I'm glad my friend Anaveria is doing well. Be well, Commander Shepard. You will not see me again. Shepard? The news said you were dead. 
What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. I'm Gianna Parasini, Noveria Internal Affairs. You screwed over my corruption investigation of Administrator Analeas. I was worried about bigger problems at the time. Saren was trying to destroy the galaxy. No kidding. And using our labs for his experiments. Man, we caught some heat over that one. Anyway, I eventually got Analeas fired for screwing an Asari tax inspector, so it worked out. Have a seat. You can buy me a beer. What Ugh. brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. Ahead. I'm working on a top secret project, mostly putting together a team and doing research right now. Sounds vague. No offense taken. I've been undercover enough to know how it goes. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've got to go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. commando unit before few humans have I'll make it simple either you pay me or I flay you alive with my mind Shepard Nixeris hold my calls My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. It's good to see you too, Liara. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... well, for the past two years. And now you're back, gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. That's not exactly public knowledge. Neither is you being alive, Shepard. Information is my business now, and if you need information on finding people, I'm happy to help. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with Tracking Officer Dara. You can find Dara at the Transportation Hub. Why would Samara have to register with a Tracking Officer? Is she a criminal? No. In fact, she's quite the opposite. Samara is a Justicar, one of an ancient sect of Asari warriors. Dara can tell you more. I'm looking for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. That was all just off the top of your head? I'm a very good information broker, Shepard. The world of intrigue isn't that different from a dig site. Except that the dead bodies still smell. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. What about you, Liara? I could use your help on this mission. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. I won't take up any more of your time. Let me know if you need information. I'll do what I can to help. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Are you a Quarian or Volus who is tired of being passed over for promotions because of discrimination against... Let's see. The just a car. Transport hub.
Listen, I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky I got out at all. Her mercenaries were starting to shoot. Goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know. No, I haven't. Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or did she kill somebody already? Relax. I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Hmm. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off this world. Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. I should go. Nothing to see here. Move along. be a Justicar when I was young. Every Asari does, I guess. Cops don't admit it, but the Eclipse sisters run this area. Oh, there's a police station right there. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. <laughs> I need to recruit Samara for my mission. Then we'll be on our way. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. That's convenient. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. 
Her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. I have to go. Good luck. Let's find Samara before the detective has to. Those were my best troops. Tell me what I need to know, and I will be gone from here. Where did you send her? You think I'd betray her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar. <laughs> What was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. <laughs> My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? I'm Commander Shepard. And I need your help with a critical mission, Samara. You honor me, but I am in the middle of an investigation. I need you to help me take down the Collectors. The Collectors are a worthy foe. I would relish testing myself against them. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. There must be some way we can all get what we need. I see a way. While I am in custody, you find the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well, I've got to get back to my station. And I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard.
right there. Pulled her up past her. Hello again, Earth Clan. Did you speak to the detective? Why are the mercs after you? I know nothing about any mercenaries, Earth Clan. I'm merely an innocent merchant trying to make his way in life. The Eclipse are out for your blood. I need your help to break into their base. Shouldn't we work together? Yes. You're right, Earth Clan. I'm desperate. I've got angry mercs after me, and now this Asari Justicar. Let's talk. I smuggled a chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse. So they are perturbed and want to kill me. It sounds like you're a swindler and your actions finally caught up with you. True and true. But I haven't survived as a merchant this long without being able to tell when there's a deal in the making. You want something. The Eclipse recently smuggled someone off-world. I need the name of the ship she left on. I don't know about their people smuggling operations. They must keep records in their base. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. Piper, stop. Look out! Put it out. No. They should uh, punch through their armor. I walked out. I walked out of the room to see what was going on with this uh oh.
Sorry about the sound. Just realized it was all janky. Um, so one thing about the... I'm recording this off of Xbox and just going straight to uh, um, Twitch. One thing about it is you have to... Uh, for some reason you have to have it go... You have to have a party check. Make it properly go through. And for some reason, if you're gonna party by yourself, it will randomly close the party chat. Ship above.
Yeah, 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 yeah. This looks like a shipping manifest. It shows the Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of red sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves that the Volus is a criminal. Detective Anaya should see this. We've got to keep moving. Think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. You need help. You need help. For you stand before the mightiest biotic ever. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. But I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Good luck with... everything. Wait, Earth Clan. You're just in time to witness my crowning achievement. The leader of the mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasea about like a rag doll. He's in no condition to fight. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. Wasea will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic rich blood will be the last step. But, Great Wind, Biotic God, I'm, I, what was I saying? I'm tired. You may be right. Yes, I'm tired. I'll nap. Destroy the universe later. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off-world. First a Justicar shows up, now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass! ship must be around here. It's gotta be the ship Samara wanted. Should we head back to the police station and give her the name, or look around first? Let's give her the name and keep moving. 
Yeah. If you have something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. The Eclipse smuggled an Ardat Yakshi off-world. She's who you're really after, isn't she? You continue to impress. Yes, I was here tracking the Ardat Yakshi. She is a dangerous criminal, and I will bring her to justice. After your mission is complete, of course. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service, so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. I can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable heroes. Shall we return to your ship? I need to speak to the detective. Thanks for getting Samara out of my district. I can tell my granddaughters about meeting a Justicar. And you've just upped my chances of living long enough to have grandkids. I have proof that Eclipse killed the Volus merchant. Let's see what you've got there. Interesting. But I can't verify it. It would be inadmissible. I vouch for Shepard, and any evidence he brings forward. I accept the judgment of the Justicar. Thanks, Shepard. I wasn't sure about trusting a stranger, and a human at that. But you came through. It's a shame this Elnora escaped. But I'll get her. At least you put her on the run. Okay, enough with all the congratulations. I've still got a spiraling crime rate. Goodbye. I have proof that Pitney Four smuggled in red sand in illegal weapons tech. I'll send in some officers to arrest him and his cohorts. This is a big help, Shepard. I can't do much to thank you, but we do have a small discretionary bounty fund. Take this. I'll be on my way. Be well. Value the Justicar. I've never heard of one working with a human before. I am ready to leave, if you are. Shall we return to your ship? Let's go. Alright, and that is the mission to get the just a car. Um, a little bit longer than I expected, but we got it done. I want to thank you for watching this episode. I will see you tomorrow with another. We'll be probably recruiting the assassin. Alright, thank you, and goodbye.